the Atlantic Ocean near Bermuda, or Antarctica, the Mediterranean, the Caribbean, the Red Sea, the Indian Ocean. Journeys from the log book of a ship, a very special ship that is helping to rewrite our understanding of the history of the Earth. The Earth. It sits there in the void of space, serene, quiet. To the astronaut traveling in space, it is home. And from his distant viewpoint, it seems that only the weather changes. But even as we look at it, it's changing in constant flux. And when the changes are compressed on a scale of time, they're dramatic, catastrophic. The continents, for instance, they were not always where they are now, nor the seas. Since the beginning, there has been constant motion, breaking up, drifting apart, filling in, and it continues today. That very special ship, the Glomar Challenger, serves as a floating laboratory to aid scientists in finding out what the changes were, when they occurred, and what they might be in the future. The ship is the laboratory, the laboratory is the ship.